I feel back. I can't lean back, back on the bench without sliding. I'm going back to the back support. Yeah. I feel downtrodden. Hey, can uh, do we have a camera on Bob still? No, he's moved. No. Uh, you can rotate the the cam there if you want to. It's not really being used right now for anything. So I got, I got, I got. It's gonna be like really up in your face. Hello. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> this is right on your tits. Oh, that's very entertaining. Oh gosh. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> that is super close. I love it. Love it. Okay. Very, very entertaining. What's up? Give me an option. Okay. Mount Town. So, to recap a little bit here, uh, the party just disarmed a fourth uh, bomb. Sexy Badger. And all the guys like, I gotta, I gotta take this, this part away again. I don't like you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. He, he, he gingerly picks up the thing. We'll, we'll be sure to, to do something nice for you at some time in the near future. As soon as he leaves, I'm gonna look at Kane. What should we do for him? So, I've got this. Okay. We should kill him. Go and uh, talk to Marissa. Marissa. It's uh, about bankrolling him. Uh, it's, uh, like, like a week for, in the sex for, for, for a little while. Okay. He seems like he's been very helpful. So, very much so. He saved the city as many times as we have. Just make sure to, to let him know. If a steam on us. So that, that we that we're the ones that hooked him up. Very good. Via you, of course. Well. <laughs> if you catch what I'm saying. <laughs> yes, because because thieves can't be supposed to be that flashy. Yeah. Nasty <laughs> big pointy <laughs> Uh, so, into the creek. Harry, Harry Potter. Yeah. <laughs> so back to the heist. No. What? We haven't really talked about that. We 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 should talk about it, but we should also finish the bombs before the heist. The bombs will be there. No, they won't. They'll explode. <laughs> That's kind of the whole point of bombs. The bombs will be there. Portions of the bombs will be there. <laughs> As well as people. A little bit of people. No, little bits of people. Okay. You're so, still. He, he takes the, the actual explosive part. We put the we put the powder in our box. Okay. The 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 noise upstairs seems to die down once that's locked away <laughs> again. Um, Harriet takes the empty not empty box and we'll bring it, I guess, out uh, to a point where uh, Marissa just kind of says, "Put it." Time. Got things to do. Sun's probably starting to uh, get real low. It is. Sun's getting real um, low, big guy. It, <laughs> it's, it's, it's exactly uh, where my mind went. At this point, it's about maybe uh, 730, 745 ish. You've been down in the basement of the next right about half an hour. Uh, I'm guessing you go upstairs now. And you're in the sex bedroom. So we've got two bombs left. Yes. Numbers one and five, I believe. Two one one and five, yeah. Okay. Yeah, one and five. At least. Let's just hope that the sixth that we found, since it was planted right then when we were there at the, at the bazaar, means that that was the last one. Why would you remember the bombs? Why would you want people to know how many bombs? <laughs> mm. To screw with more them. tip, more panic. Presumably, yeah. the only piece to survive would be the number. I can either think, 
hey, there's gonna be, you know, six bombs, or there could be infinite bombs. I mean, you really just don't want to. Well, no, think about it this way: one. if one goes off, like if the one at the the bazaar had gone off, and the only piece to survive had been the number six bounce the scene, they're like, oh shit, there's five more. Yeah. yeah. But, if, it would, if just it would the number, increase panic. If just the number one would have been there, it could be like, there were like 30 more bombs, maybe. I don't know how many bombs there were. That's true. Bad super villains. So That'd let's go... You said the tower was the other location that you could think of? Wizard's Tower. Well, and... I, I think the market is a good one, too. The market we, would be easier to scout out while everyone's... We went to the market. We went to the sewers. Uh, yeah, the, of, the, the, the of the market. Went to the farmer's market. Alright, so that's a good point. But eliminating the market would be... I mean, that leaves us very few options for the remaining two bombs. So there wasn't one in the coffer house. That we know of. That we discovered. So there's very... And if it goes off in there, the, it, I doubt the powder will get very far. Oh. That's fair. It's a, the, it's a very solid building. If it's locked up in the vault. But vaporize some gold and it, cer- it certainly could uh, dismantle many of the security systems that are magical, and that could also uh, be an opportunity for them to ga- uh, gain finances to bankroll their, uh, the, their, the rest of their operations. Well, so if the one to gain finances, <laughs> to bankroll well, if the if the one in charge of the whole operation is sold to Spainbringer himself, which is kind of obvious at this point then they have as many finances as they need. I mean... He's the leader of the city. Yeah, it's just one smaller city. I mean... It's a in pretty town. large city, is it not? I mean, it's not. It's no Sarkak city, but it's... In this part of the world, it's... I mean, this part of the country. It's, it's, it's a pretty good size. It's like Detroit size? City. Uh... Like Huntington? <laughs> 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 there's about <laughs> when okay, so there's a lot more people here than normal. When when the trials aren't going on, there's probably about fifteen to twenty thousand people. So wait, the when the Coliseum where we got the that bomb <clears throat> is that where the trials Actually, are taking place? Yeah. I'm gonna bump that up to that's more like fifty. Like thirty thousand. Yeah. Alright, so the Coliseum, that, that's where the trials are actually taking place, right? Like on the yeah. Coliseum floor? So there's, like, nowhere else in the Coliseum where... No, there's just one big arena that they retrofit for various trials. Isn't there an academy here? Yeah, the Wizard Tower. The University. The University Tower. Yeah, is, is there, yes. Alright, so that, I think that should be our next stop. It's a lot more ground to cover, but I would say probably restricted to the common areas, okay. where there's going to be a lot of people. Absolutely. Is that where you're going now? That's what I say. I don't know about the rest of y'all. What does everybody else think? Uh, Sounds good. Yeah. Uh, I'm just going to tag along, just in case you need uh, a little bit of luck. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. I need to go to the University Tower anyway. It is getting late. Uh, the lights, the, the light outside has dimmed considerably. By the time you get to the uh, University Tower, it is 8.15 or so on the fifth evening of the trials. So you have about 24 hours as of this point. Until our dinner. Until the party. And you... I kind of want to find all the bombs before the party. Maybe they have the bomb at the party. That's, pro- that's, that's what I'm thinking. Is what? They have, we saw... They, they, they did say they saw some people in, like, cloaks and whatever going into the Golden Sphere. Yeah. What you notice um, about the, the, the outskirts, so to speak, of, of the university is that this is where a lot of the materials for the trials organized. So they have it's a, it's a huge standing area. A ton of storage boxes. Balls. Like no bomb. 
That's where like miles. <laughs> like it's organized such that there are like Bomb miles balls. of stack boxes. That's where it's hidden at. Mm. It's going to be hard. To we find. need help. I have um, an idea. I also have an idea. What is your idea? Uh, we not heisting. No, we, we we rob a bank. We basically have. We need something that emits light, but is like magical. And we, like, we have a building cave. Like a torch. Yeah, but it's gonna be magical. And we kind of run it against the torch? boxes. Well, yeah. no, it's yeah. a problem. It, it, well, it's, no, it's the whole problem was that the idea is uh, we tried that with the cloak of Billy. Billy, yeah. Yeah. Um, it's in a lead line box, so the anti magic can't get out anyway. Mm-hmm. Like, what I'd like to do, um. Who, which one of us is the fastest? You. You, you are the fastest. I can fly pretty quick. You can fly. Can someone go back to the bazaar and get anyone who is currently not doing something? Yes. <laughs> Just tell them all to meet us here. And we will co-op them to help search. Oh, so we need like a big group of people. Yes. And we need people we can trust. And I trust my family. Carnies. <laughs> Hey, they, they are loyal to the family. Okay. That's true. I will true. go back and tell the matron to... Tell my mother. Her mom. Whatever. Genevieve. Genevieve. Love girl. Um, to organize the <laughs> search party. Get get as many people as possible to the, to the tower. Okay, I'll do that. I uh, cast spot. Okay. And Zoom! Fly away. Using double action. Yes, yeah. you can get back. Well, that'll give us time to go talk to the people in charge here. That's true. Okay. So, yeah, I'm going to find someone official looking. Yeah. That sounds fair. Okay. So, we do that. Um, the entryway into the university is not locked. Um, it's, a, it's a fairly unassuming looking made of sandstone, or seemingly made of sandstone. There are runes on it, kind of magically strengthened and all that kind of stuff. Um, it's maybe 80 foot diameter, kind of. It's pretty sizable tower. It goes up maybe 10 stories. Very big, stumpy looking, though, based on its uh, girth. So to speak. Uh, yeah. Yep. That's 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 the dude. That's the word I use. Um, it is substantial. And you enter, and there's a bunch of people milling about in here. The lowest floor is indeed. Um, there's kind of a, a, a front space. Because this is the largest ring, so to speak, the like largest section. It is the primary library. All right, I'm gonna look for someone who just looks official, like with either barking orders or, um, you know, behind a big desk. Okay. You see? Behind the desk. An elf. A lady elf. His name is Whoops. <laughs> okay. What was that? Taking this place out of jail. Seeing if they're if they they're they been serve properly the punished. You still have, are in. Are in <laughs> you will uh, stay in the jail. Uh, she she does she she's reading a book and is not really paying a lot of attention to the goings on around. Um, but 
you, when, when you approach where she is seated, she kind of looks up and says, "May I help you?" Yes, uh, my name is Aloysius Carly. I'm with Steve Nonas. Let me do the thing again. Glad I put it here. <laughs> As these are my compatriots. Um, is there somewhere we could talk privately? Yeah. And she kind of uh, escorts you to a like a, a study wing <laughs> kind of a thing. Um, there's actually a, a practice dummy in there, but there's nobody else in there. Just a practice dummy and maybe a few uh, other things on which you can practice magic and the like. And, and she I'm shuts the door. I'm guessing you all go along? Yeah, yeah. I'm staying next to him. I'm still coming back from the uh, Right. The you, you're not there. Yeah. So we've got a bit of a situation. Uh, by the way, what is your name? Uh, Atalia. A-T-A-L-Y-A. My name's Atalia. And, and your position here at the university? So I have a lot of questions from someone else. Still on us. Head librarian, okay. Yes. So I do not wish to alarm you, and I don't know if we should get someone else involved in this, uh, but there have been bombs placed all over the city. And we think that your university may be a target. Sense. We're, we're thinking it's anywhere with large amounts of people. We've taken out one at the Colosseum, okay. one at the nicer Sexy Badger. That's what happened out. Yes, that is what blew up in the desert. Out in the, the tent city area. Okay. Yes, the one was in the bazaar. That was the first okay, one we found. Two, two days ago. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Um, Actually, no, that was yesterday. Wasn't it? It was like, it was like the wee hours of the fourth. Yeah. yeah. Wee hours. I thought we were in the seventh day. Yeah. No, no. We're still on the day fifth day. Because day, day, day six is the party. Mm. Yeah. So yes, that is that is what went off out in, out by the tenth city, because the first one that we found was at Crowley's Dream Bazaar, my 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 family's bazaar. And we How found. We found another in the sewers, so anywhere that is populated seems to be a target. Okay, and we need to search your, your facilities. We need to search anywhere that, that large groups of people congregate. So we're thinking the staging area outside and the library itself may be targeted. Because um, we don't have any boxes or crates right or whatever. Right probably not here. So probably in the staging area. Likely in the staging area. I imagine um, and I would ask you to, you know, to help us search. Um, I know that magical means may be difficult in using it to find these items, uh, because, and I, and I'm like, uh, uh, what well, is his name? Um, Hold on, what is this? Sorry, shit. Clank. Yeah. Can you pull out the red box? You have the bag of holding. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Boom. I'm gonna, and I'm just going to open it a crack. And like half of the lights go out. And I'm gonna close it. That is the problem. Strobe light. So it is. <laughs> right. Bloodline box. Masks. I love dubs, man. Exactly. We probably uh, mask any scarring attempts. Okay. Um, can you detect magic? I do not have that ability. Party. Nope. As you can see, we is noobs. <laughs> well, because actually, no. The Harriet should have that option. Oh, actually, can you check if she, she? I think she if she took that, that spell. I don't think she took that spell. You don't. Sense. You don't get very many options it's as first, a ranger. It's, what level spell is that? Second. Uh, it's either first or second. I mean, uh, as a former ranger, I can probably say that it's unlikely, because they're. Because you don't get very many spells, and there are other ones that are better for that class. Yeah, I, I think it says that it doesn't work if it's inside a lead line box. Yeah, it, the things that can be blocked by like an inch of lead. That's why I didn't take yes, it. Yes, that's my point. Everything else in the box is magical. So you look for the one place that's not. Mm-hmm. 
Interesting. Yeah, that, is a, that is a very good plan. It's, a, it's, it's just too bad. An Artemis Fowl book. <laughs> My sister's here. That's why I called for a family. My sister Izora has that spell. I would, can I use my plot point to say that she has she has detect magic? <laughs> yes, you can. All right. Nice. Because I used my plot point to get her here in the first place. It is a ranger spell. Detect magic is a ranger spell. Uh, but Harriet doesn't have a protector yeah. right now. Well, it's, it's not, um. Situation useful. She didn't know that she would need that. It's not a prepared spell. Rangers have to know. Huh? Yeah, rangers don't rangers prepare that, spells. From they're the like sorcerers. They they, they, they have take a certain ones that they know. Gotcha. Okay. Well, yeah, she doesn't know. Exactly. Yeah, like, and you only get like at our level, probably like it's three. three. Yeah. She has uh, hunter's mark, cure wounds, and zephyr strike. Yeah, I have five spells. Personally, but that's a warlock thing. I've got powers. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and two um, spells. Yeah. So, my, my, my sister, who studies at the Academy in um, Tartek City, she's on her way here, and she, she, has that, she, she knows magic of that sort. She should be here soon, but we're... Um, so, I just, I just needed your permission. I don't know if we need to inform like, the headmaster of the Academy. I will send And there is one uh, one bomb still unaccounted for, just assuming that we find one here. Do you know of anywhere in the city that would also have a large population density? That isn't new. Sounds like, uh, well, what have you done so far? So far we've been to the sewers, underneath the beige market. That's a good one. Uh, we've been to the Crowley's Dream Bazaar on our opening night which had a great many people. Mm -hmm. uh, we've been to uh, the Sexy Badger, the not one of the nice side of town, okay. um, which had uh, quite a few people. Um, we've been to the Coliseum prior to one of the trials. There, I mean, there are any number of places that... Wait, if that's just one unaccounted for, the Golden Sphere is the one where we pretty much know there's going to be a bomb, right? I mean, unless there's more than six, we may have accounted for all of them because we think the last will be uh, set off tomorrow night at the Golden Sphere. And just in case we die and no one knows what caused this, it was so Bringer. Name drop. Bike drop. <laughs> so, and this is where she's like, oh, she is, let me get your tinfoil hats real quick, too. Yeah, she's like... Give me a persuasion check. I'll do better. I will pull out my bomb part that has Soda's Banebringer written on it. Why would you give your bill while you write your name with your bomb parts for? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's, he, he fucking signed his bombs. <laughs> It's like, if you have the ability to see into the ethereal plane, like with true sight, his name is written yes. right here. And she, she does a little spell. Her <laughs> eyes kind of flash a little bit, and she, she sees it. Yes, me. No, it says Soda's Banebringer. It actually says Soda's oh, Banebringer right. on it. Okay. <laughs> yeah. And I'm going to produce the I mean, note that to says, me it disarmed sounds like my bomb. Yeah. <laughs> pretty, yeah. Yeah. pretty little uh, slacking one. <laughs> Yeah, and I'm gonna produce the note that he sent me that you disarm, you disarm my bomb, you die first. So Lysias signed SB. Camera, camera footage. She reads that note. She says, hmm. <laughs> "Okay." That is fine. We're gonna go find the bombs now. Bye, thanks for your help, whatever your Just name. Make sure it's a headmaster of the, of the, of the Academy knows, and I'll be out of your hair. Mm. Goodbye. Yeah. She like you just info dumped all over her and she's like <laughs> We needed to tell somebody important. Yeah. So yeah. <laughs> Yep. Um, 
No, they haven't made it back yet. Well, we'll start searching while they're on their way back. Okay. And this time... I, I need investigation check. Right, I'm Is assisting that... Kane this time, so you have, you have advantage. Nice. Nice. I'm not doing anything. Nice. Uh, it's a 25. 25. Okay, good. It looks like this. <laughs> you are in a uh, question. So you're you're helping. <coughs> him, so you're with him. Uh, where is everyone else? I'm I'm gonna stick as close as possible to the people invested. In, you just kind of hang. Yeah, out. I'm just in gonna case we find the bomb. Yeah, in case you guys yeah. find the bomb, I'm keeping an eye out. Okay. Yeah. Those of you that are not investigating, give me perception checks, please. I'm still on my back. I count as you investigating because I'm helping him, yes. right? Yeah. You are still on your back. Yes. So that's you and pers- yeah. and Christian. Uh, this is close to one of the time. Like you, you're you're close. Oh, that's a cock die. Not quite there. Yeah. Just wait, wait, wait. You have to tell Gerald. Cock die. Can't see where. Yeah. Would you probably dog? Oh, nice. And what is this? A perception. Yeah. No, nice. Yeah. Uh, twenty-three. Nice. Right. No. Uh, twenty. Twenty-four. Twenty-four. Thank you. Yep. She's she, she like, but people! Here it is. No, the puppy down. Come on, come here. As you are. Oh, yeah. Come here. Let's go out. Come here. You find several. <laughs> New location, new things. Yes. Crazy dog. Uh, all right. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, she got really excited. She's like, oh my god, he's talking to me. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> you start to search. You don't find it, but... We clear like these I'm, locations. I feel like you're in the right place. Yeah, like a significantly narrowed. Like the, at this point, after we found several of them, so I feel like I'm starting to like get in the minds of like the people who are placing yeah. these, and like they're like, okay, if I were yeah. placing the bomb, where am I going to put it, exactly. and then follow the trail that way. Exactly. And uh, <coughs> Clank, yes. with your perception check, you see a series of strangely dressed individuals begin to observe. Mm. They have on their robes they have what looks to be like a, a, a swirling one. Oh shit. Ending in an eye eyeball? Yes. Fuck! Stab him. Stick him. Stick Hey, weirdly dressed people. Stick them. <laughs> to be precise. Wait, you, you point them out to us, right? Yes. Six of them. All right. Begin I, approaching. Now. I materialize my boat. <laughs> okay. You said they're at a distance, right? They are. Well, they're they're probably... Because they, there's a bunch of crates stacked up pretty high. So, you kind of turn around a corner. There may be... 40 feet away from you. Um, let's see. So they obviously see me, or all of us. Huh? About me, because I'm not there. Yeah. They're making no attempt to hide. No. They must be Oh my god. Uh, Surprise round. Wah, 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 it's flashing. I can't be surprised. <clears throat> I can't be surprised, though. Huh? Okay. I'm just saying. <laughs> And neither can my allies within 30 feet of me. Cool story, bro. What is your uh, armor class? 17. Cool. Uh, Dead. So. He kills you. Wipe yourself off. You notice 
right before they go off, there are two um, stealth individuals on the other side coming from the other direction. And they shoot you. They cool. both shoot you. Uh, you died first. Yeah. And how did I miss that? Um, the crit. Oh my god. Do, do they get sneak attack if I'm not surprised by them? Yes, they do. They get Damn whatever it. he wants them to get. And I'll. Uh, yeah. It's because they're assassins. Well, the assassinate feature only works against surprise creatures. No. The assassinate feature works against any creature that hasn't taken a turn. Oh, that's right. Damn it. So, I, I appreciate the attempt there, but, uh, no. I tried. That you did. I'm gonna die. Uh, it's very possible. <laughs> Rip Crowley. <laughs> he did say you die first. He did say you die first. Well, the hit squad's here. Alright, we're gonna do the crit first. Oh, that's a lot of dice. <laughs> that really is. Is there, way, is, there, is there any way for me to use a lock point to help him at all? I rolled two ones, though, so that's good. <laughs> I rolled two sixes. <laughs> and a five. Okay, hang on. So, starting with the max damage. 32. We're at... Plus uh, whatever the modifier is. Let's see. Uh, eight plus four is 32, right? Plus three I can see the dice from here. Is 35. Uh, 36, 37. 42. 54. I'm down. Jesus. 54 damage. I have 50 hit uh, points. That's my maximum. You get hit. Um, the second one, because you are incapacitated. Mm -hmm. I get two death bales. Auto crit. You lose two death saves. Oh, oh my god. god. Oh, Lord. <laughs> and I need everyone to roll initiative. Okay. <laughs> this, this is going to be dear to the mind. Except for me, because I'm not there. Except for you, because you're not. <laughs> I got a decent right initiative, decision. so when my next death save rolls around, <laughs> Quetzal's not down the night. So, wait. You all? I, I got 20 total. Nice. Um, hey, Gerald, my, yes. my weapon of warning gives me advantage on initiative, but I assume I need to be conscious for that. I will, I will allow you to, to have initiative. Do you do you want initiative? Well, really? I need a death... I have one death saving throw remaining, unless they take another shot at me while I'm down. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> <laughs> He, yeah, so this doesn't mess around, man. Apparently not. He don't. He don't, he don't. Let's see. Um, hang on. I, I gotta roll for some So give me some. Birdsman, bring the cavalry. <laughs> I'm going to die. Hey, if I Hopefully die... Hopefully you brought several people. <laughs> if, if I die, I have a backup, so we're okay. 16 plus... So the assassins go on initiative count 19. I go before them, yay! I might hey. have a chance to get one success in before they kill me. That's convenient. We can get you. <laughs> you too? Me too. Okay. And I probably have higher dexterity than them. What, what's your dexterity? 20. Yes, you do. <laughs> there are very few things that have higher dex than me. <laughs> That's true. Ever. Ever seen a quickling? <laughs> okay. Yes. 20. Hmm. I actually go before you. What did you roll? Uh, Natural 18 plus 2. Crowley. Uh, let me roll for her area here. She gets advantage. Both 17. So that no, works I need out alert. Plus I need that alert. Oh, yeah, next? Okay. That's One. level 8. Yeah. So 18 for... No, if I fail my death save, then then it's going to take a resurrection spell to bring you back. Yeah, yeah. yeah we got to get you. <laughs> yeah, you should have right. rolled uh, 17. I know. 17. Does anyone go before me? Shit. Not yet. <laughs> yeah. That's why I was like, do you oh. want to take initiative on that? Well, yeah. I, have, I have to have initiative for a death saving throw. It's just... Well, I know that, but I was, you know, predicting the floor was lower. Uh, okay. 12. Okay. No, no, my first roll was the 20. <laughs> oh, gosh. Yeah. Okay. My second roll was an 8. And just oh, for the sake of... Oh, okay. I have one, but... <clears throat> To engage movement, because I imagine that natural twenty. Wow. <laughs> there you go. Oh. Yeah, he's not here though. <laughs> Quetzal. Quetzal's the top of the round. Top of the round is indeed Quetzal. So you 
percentile to see how close it is. Okay, well, I, let me Hold your you action. Because they're pretty close to being there. But did you fly ahead? Like, did you just tell them and, like, zip on back? Yeah, that's probably what I would do. You'd have to use another use of your fly, though, because uh, fly typically only lasts 10 minutes unless you rule it differently. Shit, yeah, so if I'm... Yeah, so it took, it? It took, it you can use 15. it more than once, so yeah. you can totally do that. I've got... You wouldn't know there's any need to hurry, though. You wouldn't. But if you want to just say, hey, we need you over at the University Tower, mm -hmm. and then fly back... <laughs> Maybe they can fly, too. <laughs> uh, five no. per day, so... Yeah. But if you don't know... That that just happened. Right, no. Yeah. So, what would, would, uh, would Quetzal... Quetzal would just, fly back. Like, would, would be like, hey, we need you over here. Hey, he's me a sayer. <laughs> Quetzal just wants to fly for who here. So, that's fine. Um, you arrive, and you're... Let's say for the sake of, of your turn, right? You arrive, um, and you're about 50-ish feet away. Before, like, when you see <laughs> Crowley just get wrecked. <laughs> I just get two crossbow bolts, I mean, like, right in the neck. Yeah. I mean, it's it's basically, it's pretty familiar from uh, episode two. <laughs> when you died. Yeah. Or was that, a, that was episode one, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. Yeah. Uh, wrecked. <laughs> and he, he falls down on his face, basically. Um, and we'll say that that's, like, where you are, because you've been basically double doing to mm -hmm. get here. Okay. Um, Crowley, I need you to make a death saving throw, please. I don't think you have anything that gives you advantage. No, except for me. Um, you, you've already used your plot point. Yep. Uh, you can, theoretically, he can use a luck point, which th this will be your third one? Doesn't matter. Any Anything that he gives me. Well, one, one, plot one. Yes, I did. Plot point. We already used the... You, you I used my... Spend your plot point. I'll use my oh. plot point. Okay. That will give you a reroll. Four. I'll use my plot point. <laughs> okay. All right. Dude. Thirteen. Nice. <laughs> Thank you, guys. I my plot point. Two plot points spent. <laughs> oh. Thanks, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't matter, though, because the assassins go after me. And that was just a death saving throw. That was you one death save. Next I need two more. Is pain. Um, since he's, like, right there with me, I'm going to... Use your action. You, use an, yeah, state, use my standard action and give him one of my potions. And force, force feed. We'll just give it to him. Yeah, no, I'm just... I'm, I was like assassin. giving it to you. You and gain 10 hit points. You're going to piss off those assassins. Resets your uh, death saving throw. <laughs> is there. <laughs> is there any way that I can bring a traveler with me uh, through Shadow Step at like half speed or like higher <laughs> SP? Okay. No. Oh, that's what I figured. Um, Thank you. Get away now. Okay. Well yeah. then. Yeah. He like pulls out the bolts and then like dumps the potion on, <laughs> on the wounds and they close up. And you're like. And you're like sputtering, coughing, laying prone. Well, it's basically. Thank you. Get away now. <laughs> so, I have a plan. And I'm. I'm. Okay, I'm still going because it's it's dark out now, right? She's oh yes, it's dark. Plan. Yeah. It's fantastic. I mean, obviously, those two. There are um, like the sort of ever burning, ever burning torch kind of thing. So there is dim light. Is yeah. everywhere. But it's not. Really it's okay. pretty dark out. So, like you said, the, they were up on like top of crates. No, you know? they kind of um, like peeked out from like some, some side aisles on the other side of where the. Okay, okay, well, and they were like, were they across from each other, or yeah, were they so together? Like you're, you're in the middle, Cultists are coming from this direction, and the two assassins were... Uh, okay, yeah. um, I would like to use, go ahead and shadow step actually behind one of them. Okay. Um, like, did they like pop out of like a little alley between like some crates, or are they just yeah. like... Okay. Because 
the the crates are set up to where they're sort of main thoroughfares and then little side. I, I'm yeah. I'm picturing like a, a, a shipping dock with all the big cargo crates. Yeah. Yeah, that's kind of what I was too. Yeah. With the warehouse mini engines. Kind of like the yeah. warehouse mini Yeah, there it is. That's a good. There it is. That's a good. With wooden idea. crates and everything. Okay, yeah. Um, I want to shadow step, but well, shoot, no, no, actually, I don't want to do that because I already used my action to feed him a potion, right? It's, it's not that, an action to shadow step. Though. It's about no, action. I mean, like the the feed him the potion. Yeah, that was an action. Oh. Yeah, so that I wouldn't be able to attack. Surprise. That's true. That's, that's, that's my point. Um, Surprise! Oh, God! <laughs> it's like, hey! I'm going to get you <laughs> next round. In six seconds. Um, okay, never mind. I'm going to... No cultists. That's lovely. Oh, yeah, dude. Oh, yeah. I'd like to sort of... Dip around the nearest corner and try to uh, scurry up on top of some crates then. Okay. And like, sort of like, lay flat and hide. Sort of up, like, like get up there and like, be like... Be prone. Yeah. Lay prone. Okay. Gotcha. And can do acrobatics to like, flip up or, or like... Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I, Quick move I would imagine there. that you are, because they're just like regular boxes. They'd be easy to yeah. find up those. I don't think you're even going to roll that. I mean, you seem to be like... I think your bonus is okay. It's a ten. It's yeah. a ten. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. Ten. <laughs> anyway. Um. Oh, and can I stealth check up there? Such that. Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, so the bonus action high. Yeah. Okay. Hot behind them. Don't look at the. And that's a twenty-two. Wow. Okay. I get a plus nine. That's pretty dope. I mean, that's. I get, the, I get that proficiency, or double right. proficiency, that plus five from Dex. The assassin. So they see that I'm alive. Oh, yes. Oh, good. Yep. Bye again. <clears throat> Later. All right. Good luck to you. The first assassin shoots at Crowley. <laughs> where, where were they? So you were the first to die. That may not hit. It was the total. 14. Nope. Nope. 17. That hit. Shield. I have my reactions back. I cast shield. What's your... Plus, arm? it makes makes it plus 5. So Which is... Makes it 22. 22. Ooh, that's 21. Nice. Yes. Nice. <laughs> Very nice. Okay. Harriet. Well, that Harriet was handy. is going to... Rush um, the cultists actually to sort of try and keep them away from you because uh, there's quite a few over there. And she's going to attempt to. Her movement speed's pretty good. If I recall, it's it's just thirty. She can't really get all the way to that Can she get to the robes? She has hand axes. Oh, yeah, okay, that's fair. Just, yeah. So Naruto, and then... She'll do a hand axe. Wait, she's, she didn't make fifth level, right? Mm-hmm. Not yet. She's like 85 experience points away from it, though. Because that would give her two attacks. Yeah, she doesn't have Hand axe plus six is 18, which will very definitely hit a cultist. Because cultist does not have a very high... I'll be right back and use that one. What is that? A D6? Yeah, it's a D6 plus her strength modifier. Okay, that's a total of 7 damage. So she grievously wounds one of these cultists. Thank you for drawing fire. I'm in very much pain. (laughs) (laughs) I hope it's done. Like... She, she hits this cultist in the, 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 the sternum. sternum. And like, the axe is cut in deep. And you, can, and, and you can see the cultist like drop down on the hands like, yeah, it's not, it's not, it's not good. No bueno. Clank. All right. Yeah? yeah um. 
has such high initiative as like crazy. Except for Krishna. Yeah. <laughs> so that one's just like, ah damn. Ooch hurting. And that's one of the ones I shot at him. No. That's just one, one of the cultists. One of the cultists. Ah. The assassins haven't even been targeted yet. See, the problem is I gotta, gotta, gotta fucking enlarge, and that's my action. You or you can just attack. I know. The only thing that enlarge does for It gives you me an extra d4. It gives you an extra d4 damage. Right. Which is not terrible. Which on a crit gives you four extra damage. It's not still. The nuts. Okay. You know what? At least uh, four. I'm well, just at least five. Well, shoot. No, it's four. I mean, you get additional damage die. Plus you roll it. Well, yeah, true. I'm saying, but like, never mind. Yeah. yeah, you get at least five because it's four plus it's level one on that. It's an extra. Yeah, so ain't bad. I mean, I only do eight. Yeah, one d eight plus dude, two. It's up to you, man. Yeah. All right. Woo 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 woo. I'm taller. Are you going to move in or toward them? Uh, I want to. You actually have enough speed to get up on them. I mean, yeah, there's no point for me to get close right now. Okay. Yeah. So I'm actually getting closer to him. Okay. So yeah, that's all I did. Be protectory. Uh, we'll call myself a meat shield. Mm. Except you're not meat. Gotcha. You're just cultists, a shield shield. The cultists <laughs> who are. Uh, huh? I said you're not meat. Now yeah, I'm chill about chill. ten feet or so away from Harriet. We're gonna move up and attack her. Uh, speaking of which, I need a pencil. Her Here. <laughs> That is not my fault. I know. <laughs> We're good. All right, let's see what they got. I just now realized that my pies aren't pies at all, but they're actually a hot curry. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> and you can well, I just call it that. Like you can flavor it however you want. To. They also blind cheese. Make a shit flavor. I have that on the uh, like in in the arcane chef description. Like this is just. It's sort of general Temple. descriptor. You can call it whatever you want. Maybe hot pockets. I like, I like hot pockets. Right. They also bind people. So Harriet gets like. surrounded by cultists. Um, one of them seems to be like the, the leader of sorts. Um, ooh. That's nasty. Oh, wow. Ooh. So I can't roll. Her AC is 17, which is very nice. Uh, so, two cultists miss. This is two more. Um, what is it going to Not much. Okay, ducky. Okay. Um, one of those will hit, just ever so barely, dealing a delightful four. Reaches out towards area and goes to make a touch attack. Maybe. Nope. Fails. That sucks. Flaws. Flaws. Well my cultists. Flaws. Suck it, cultists. Krishna. Uh, so you, you got two options. The assassins are technically speaking a little bit. Well, no, at this point, the cultists would be closer because they moved up to attack her. So they're all surrounding her? They're all encircled yeah, her? Yeah, there's six cultists, and they're kind of, she's large, so they're kind of around her front space. So they're in front of her, but they're not, like, encircling her. Well, it's enough that... He didn't die. That's a good point. Nope, you're welcome. Hang on. Some of them are flanking. <laughs> which gives one more hit. <laughs> that's not really. Ooh, that's not nice. Uh, so she takes another six points. Uh, so how can how many of them could I hit with the breath weapon without hitting Harriet? Well, that's a clean three. Yeah, good enough. Yep. So you move up and position yourself such that you can hit three of the cultists. Okay. That's right. Right, motherfucker. 
Oh, 11 Ooh, points. Nice. nice. We're not. Oh, we're not. Mac Mega, it's, it's what? So the seventh was 11. Okay. 11? Yeah. Okay. And that's 33. That's 18. That is 11. And a natural one. Okay. So the natural one takes 11 points of damage. The natural one, you and what's fire? Yeah, fire. Okay. Fire. Yeah. That's that's the closest one to you. And you just, because of his proximity, you just like roast the top half of his body. Nice. And he fuck, he's dead. He just falls over. Crispy, Motherfucker. Crispy baby. Yeah. <laughs> um, the much. other two take. Come up with a new recipe. It's like Krishna uh, comes <laughs> up. Five, five points. He's come up with a new recipe. Yeah. <laughs> nice. That's delightful. It's barbecued cultist. Um, TM. You're still uh, 50 feet out, but you're, you're basically, you can move to get right up where everyone else, where like the, the main clump of, of your party is. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to move up. Uh, I'm going to stay behind. Like, I'm, I'm, the assassins are in between me and the... Keeper. Yeah, well, yeah, so you have cultists and Harry on one side, and, and uh, Krishna is there too. And then the party. And then you have the party to the other side there. I want to get up from about 30 feet away from the assassins. Now I'm like gonna... flying above them? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It'll be above them. And I'm going to launch one of my pods out of my catapult on a spoon. Nice. Is that one of them? Spoon. 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 And hopefully I hit. Come on. I can't believe I died so quick that, that damn. That's an 11. Plus 3, 14. As soon as we got that note, I should have just stayed behind and covered it. (laughs) You got hit by both of that, so. We probably probably should have been a little more, like, cautious. Cautious (laughs) or, like, observant. 14. Like, looking for that. I mean, actually, he even told us earlier that we had people following us. You threw your. your And we didn't do a thing. But there were guards. Oh, this is so. This is terrible. Okay. Okay. Give me a percentile roll. Didn't realize you didn't put that together. No. I would have said something earlier. I figured didn't it wouldn't Didn't put it did. together at all. I thought they were the good guys. <laughs> Three. Whoa. Yep. Awesome. Your fiery lock pocket oh, no. lands on... Oh, landed on me. Why the, the fuck not? <laughs> no, you're too far away. Okay. But the point is it lands on the stack of crates that is adjacent to it. Ah, <laughs> shit. Napalm. And... <gasps> Fire oh, begins. Mother. I'll, uh, <laughs> we'll be able to check those crates pretty quick, guys. <laughs> Fire begins. Alright. Cool. Um, just burn down the slum. <laughs> no, no, you just burned down the staging area for the Trials of the Magi oh. and possibly the library. <laughs> Maybe even the whole town. <laughs> the whole town. I mean, sure. there's probably somebody who knows Cone of Cold that can, like, yeah. Or just produce flames. Or produce Not, not uh, control control flames. Yeah. I'm trying to get the music at a decent level. Where's my uh, PHP? Yeah, uh, it's right now. It's right now. Lovely. Yes. Lovely, lovely. Here we go. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> sorry. Sorry, sorry. So sorry. <laughs> sorry. Okay, cool. The fires are spreading. We'll get to that in a moment. Crowley. I'm pissed. I would imagine so. Alright, so I'm prone. Get on the up. ground. Mm-hmm. I'm going to like roll over on my stomach, reshape, reshaping my pa- packed weapon into mm-hmm. my sword, mm-hmm. and target one of the two assassins. Okay. Not getting up, because that would waste time gotcha. and movement. I might get up afterwards. So, <laughs> how, big, how close are they? Give me them toes. 40 feet or so. That's perfect. I'm going to Eldritch Blast one after using Hexblade's Curse on him. Very good. Which does what for you? It adds my proficiency bonus and damage to him, and I crit on 19s. And if he dies, 
I regain hit points. Sweet. Okay. That's what. Yeah. yeah that's that's the whole point of this. <laughs> I got you. All right. So I get two hits with that now. Okay. So natural twenty and a seven. Seven. Seven plus eight. I believe. Yeah. Fifteen. Fifteen just barely hits. I believe he's fifteen. And a natural twenty. Yeah, well, that's going to definitely is. All right, so... And it is a right nasty crit. Yeah. So that's 10 plus my die roll, and then it's plus 3 on each of those. <laughs> you don't fuck with a warlock. Okay, so Just say it. Give me thy total damages. Uh, it's 1, 6, 7, 8, We need to raise my dexterity. So it's 10, it's 17, good times. You need to diversify your damage. bonds. Total? Yes. Nice. Yeah. No, wait, 23. Can't, can't tell you the last time I, I, I played in a low dex character. So these if ever. Um, sort of glowing blue tendrils shoot out of your sword and strike the assassin. He just cries out of pain, obviously. What kind of damage is that? Uh, force. Ooh. Use the force. Ouch. Bruisey. <laughs> yeah. Not cool. Not cool, Dave. <laughs> what is that from? That sounds familiar. Minions. Or, like, Spin Woman. Ah. Yeah. The episode of Dave with one on one. Not cool, yeah. Dave. Not cool, Rand. Rand just went pretty good. Did you want to move? Yeah, I'm going to stand up and just, you know, kind of get in a battle stance. Okay. That's fair. Kane. Alright, um, so I'm up on. The little thing that like prone. Um, yeah, the fire, by the way, <laughs> that that uh, Quetzal started is beginning to edge your way. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> that's not. This is a this is a non-issue uh, for me. So I'm going to loose a dagger at. Um. I'm 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 hidden, so I've got sneak attack. From. The, or did you do perception to see if they got my, hit my 22? Uh, I'm pretty sure they don't have a lot by way of perception. <laughs> Low perceptor. No perceptor from them. Um, 23? 22. Two. 22, okay. Um, only one of the, uh, only one of the assassins knows where you are. Can I tell which one knows where I am? Uh, Is he like looking at me? Or you can see that he kind of glances up where you are. Yeah. Okay. Um, with your um, uh, passive perception, I would say that you you can spot that kind of stuff. Okay. Because it's twenty, right? Your yeah. Passive perception. Stupidly observant. Not, I mean, observant feet, man, is pretty boss. It is, man. It's Extra cool. plus five. Plus five is huge. It yeah. is. Just um, wish it went towards active instead of just passing. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Be ludicrous. Um, yeah, so actually, I'm going to go ahead. I'll loose a dagger at the one that's not paying attention to me. Okay. That would actually be the one that probably has already hit. So Lovely. It works out. Lovely. I will, you have advantage. One of them is, yeah. Oh, okay, good. All this right. Probably. Nice. Good deal. This, this is my go-to die when this one obviously kills me. Uh, yeah. right. That's a uh, 20. Yeah, I see that you have it. No. Uh, I think it's this one, actually. Cool. That will hit, for sure. Okay. All righty. So it's a dirty 20. Yes, dirty 20 indeed. Dirty 20, which is sneak attack damages. Indeed. So I got Roll them. Two of those until our next session. And you hope. I'm pretty sure. Uh, so it's going to be 15 to. You stick the dagger into his uh, mid side. No, he he hooked it. No, oh. it sticks into his side, and 
Your assassin cries out in pain. Ugh. Starts to slump a little bit, but still kicking. Still kicking, but yeah. Okay. Um, He's taking 35 damage. That's impressive. I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, I'm going to, like, dash down, like, a few more other boxes and try to, like, hide myself back behind something else again. <laughs> okay. Got it. Stick and move. Stick and move. Literally. All right, we fell. You want to grab that die? Uh, it's a 17. Take that one. Uh, no, it has to be on the table. I mean, that's that's the lower roll. <laughs> <laughs> if we want, if we want to give me disadvantage on it and take one of the two, yeah. I rolled a 19 on the table to nice. hide again, which that one. Puts me to a 28. Yeah, they can't. <laughs> they to see you even with natural Like, uh, like what? Pretty dope. Like, the one who wasn't paying attention gets hit, hit in the side, like cries out. The other one glances at him to be like, what, what just happened? And then like looks back and I'm gone. <laughs> God damn it, Batman. Like, <laughs> <laughs> pretty much. Uh, so my daggers are bat shaped. <laughs> so the wounded step back behind the, the barrier. But, well, now it's on fire. He's on fire. <laughs> that would be I'm useful, guys. <laughs> uh, he's going to move over to the other side where it's not on fire and uh, kind, of, kind of brace himself up against the wall. And he's going to Like, you all hear him shout. Guards! Guards! Okay. You know, he, he knows who the guards work for, right? I do now. I still don't think that he's the bad guy. Uh, <laughs> His just... name is on the bombs. Yeah. If I were a bad guy, I would be sent... right my name on the bombs. <laughs> he sent me a note saying you die first and signed it the SB. Other, the other assassin fellow is I'm, going to I'm shoot sure get at Crowley. Just, just do it. Yeah, because, I mean, if they didn't do the bomb, why would they all not be attack him? That is a... You don't know who these people work for? They can just say they work for uh, be a whole big conspiracy. Can shield is a reaction. Right? Yes. So it's already down because my my turn. I, right, right. Just... But like my point is, you have to not know the result of the roll. Pretty much. Okay. Well, like, are you using points? shield? Nah, I want to save my other slot. You got it. That's an eighteen bit. Okay. <laughs> Which will hit, I'm sure. Yes, it's, uh, my AC is 17. Okay, here we go. Shield will save you. That's 10 damage. Bye! <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess I'm going back to sleep, guys. Take it easy. Yeah. <laughs> Peace! A second nap. This time, the crossbow bolt hits you in the chest, and you're just like... <laughs> I, no, no, just, I, I don't so even... So I have, stand up, like, quickly the, look yeah, back at yeah, yeah. like, <laughs> well, my, my sword just vanishes, and I'm like... Hmm. <sighs> <laughs> just gotta roll my eyes, god damn it. <laughs> the cartoon pass out. Oh, man. Uh, Harriet, who is not uh, very happy right now, is going to go a little mall crazy here. Recios. So is Finn with uh, your mom or something? I'm hoping. Because he's not here. Yeah, Finn uh, Finn stayed at the circus. Yeah, your mom said, Can, I want you to help me do some heavy lifting. <laughs> <laughs> he started just moving crates around. It's right over here in my tent. Yeah. So she picked. So he picked up the bed. Yeah, he picked up the bed. <laughs> Where are the boxes at? Yeah, like, I don't understand. And she's like, you will. <laughs> uh, I can just see her trying to explain it, and after a while, just going, "God damn it, this guy's an idiot." Let's see. She is giving. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. After twenty from here. Yes. I mean, we'll see. It flashed. It's very possible. Um, oh, I was going to do... Okay. This is for Popeye. Popeye's going to attack for the first time ever. Oh. And bite 
the severely damaged call disc. <laughs> With its tiny little mouth? Yes. <laughs> That's poisonous thing. <laughs> <laughs> I can't do it. I don't know how to it's do on it. the wing. No, it's Fuck. in the center. Oh. Yes. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. <laughs> Got it. So well, let's do Harry's thing first. He's going to hit uh, the currently uninjured cultist. So there's one of those. Uh, and is that two fours? Yes, it is. Plus. Uh. Strength mod plus one. Ooh. So plus five, I believe. Plus five. That's going to be uh, enough to just... <laughs> so this cultist, who was trying to... Who, who is one of the ones that like, missed her uh, the last time. He just kind of run up. Her maw just... Whack! Pushes and, his head uh, into his pushes chest. Pushes his head into his chest. <laughs> <laughs> and the body, the body kind of stands there. Like the arms drop and the weapon falls from the hands, and it just kind of. Um, Popeye. We don't tell you about the amount of blood you see here. <laughs> oh my god. Is that a four? Yeah. Yes. Bit the shit out of him. Bit of a net. Popeye rips the throat out of his. <laughs> nice. Just like flies over. And then. And it's got huge fangs. Big pointy. First kill for Popeye. Uh, and then it kind of flies over back to Harry. Bloody mouth. Bloody mouth. <laughs> it's horrible. I didn't even. It drops the throat in front of her. Yeah. It's like, they were <laughs> cute before. They were cute. They're not cute anymore. I'm scared. So you're just gnawing on like an eyeball. <laughs> <laughs> got that motherfucker. Mm, vocal the cord. Throat. The throat. Oh, vocal throat. cord. Uh, the vocal cord. Oh, yeah. Like, yeah. Hanging out the side of its mouth. <laughs> it's like a bit of cultist flesh, and it kind of like... Mm, cultist. Like, Wash this down. Pulls it and eats it. Harriet, do you have anything to quench my thirst? I must have right. cultist. Uh, 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 clinic. What you doing, buddy? <laughs> All right. Um, you enlarged last turn. Yeah, I did. I'm going to pick you up. Or... Uh, Give you a potion, baby bird, you. That's an action. You should baby bird it. Yeah, that's an, well, that's an action. That. That's your action. I was gonna say, you want to do that? You yeah, yeah. do it. Okay. Oh, I would do. Wait. No, yeah, wait. You have death saving throws. I, I'm You're fine. I, I'm, yeah. yeah. <laughs> he, I got has, time, bro. He has not failed any death saving throws. All right. Yet. Well, then I'm gonna try to get some of this these motherfuckers out of here. So one of the assassins has actually both of them has been hurt. No. This one. One of them has been hurt. He's hiding behind him. It's crazy right now. And he had called for the guard. The uninjured one is still. Which is bad because they work for the bad guy. Mm-hmm. Alright, I want to shoot that guy. Uh, I cannot see him. He has full cover. Luckily. Luckily. I see that corner piece that I just. I just <laughs> see it over there. there. <laughs> I see that corner piece. I dash how, my, how many left points do you have total? I have five in total. I've used two. No. You used three. You've used three. No, I used a plot point. So we also no, you've used three because you we used had to, two during the disarming. Yes. And then you used one in the sewer. Uh, during uh, during his like um, it was a different check. No? No. Okay, then you oh, I used two. Yeah, he's only used That's two. Right, he checks them out okay. as he You're right. I you're didn't right. use a block point. I don't have that. You're right, you're right. So I am about to use three. Because <laughs> you know, reasons. So this doesn't give you the plus six, but it allows you to, uh, because of luck, um, ignore full cover. Yeah? Or does it give me a reroll? No, I'm, I'm, I'm. Allowing, oh, you're telling me what it does. I'm, I'm allowing you to make the shot, despite the fact that he has full cover. Kind of like when we were in that cave. Yes, because you are no, using sorry. one of your luck points. Your luck Let's go start calling you Domino. Lucky feet. So this, my lucky this, feet gives me a reroll. But my, my lucky your ability lucky stuff your lets me do points. this. Yeah. Okay. It's this this particular use is kind of circumstantial. It's not inherently written in there, but because I'm not having it give you any bonus to the roll, I'm just allowing you to make the roll. Okay. Is is, is, is how you can even do it. You can shoot at the corner and then possibly hit him. And to do it without disadvantage, which is a big deal. That's true. So uh, yeah, go for it, man. Yeah, I'll make, go for it. Make the shot if you will. 
I'm really disappointed that no one here has seen, seen the new Deadpool yet. 12 plus... How have you already seen this month? Oh, came, came out yesterday. Yeah. 16? We're going to see it someday, huh? 16? So good. 16 hits. Good deal. It's a D8. D8. Stay at the very end. Plus... Okay, it's amazing. It's, 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 it's hilarious. I'm very excited. <laughs> There's not actually an end credit scene, but the uh, very... like. There's nine. a song at the very, very nine end damage. of the credits that's worth it. Nine. 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 nine! Awesome. Nine. Um, not dead yet? God damn it. Oh, yeah. Is it the same Assassin's... one that keeps getting uh, hurt yeah. on? Yeah. Assassins have a lot of health, man. I don't anymore. No. Nope. Okay. okay, sorry. Good job. Col- uh, cultist. Okay. I want to say. I hit his yeah. elbow. Like, he they, was, like, yelling. He's like, guards! And I just shoot him right in the wrist. Ow! I'm behind a gray. How do you do that? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, cultists. Fucking fail. Horrifically. Oh. Ooh. Yes. Yes, Nia. If y'all can wake me up before the guards get here, I can possibly defuse the situation before I defuse the bomb. Harry wake him up is before he going to be up. hit uh, with... I can disguise myself um, into one of the assassins and say it's all taken care of. Uh, <laughs> they're all alive still. Harry I've taken them into custody. We're going to take care of this wounds. in the soups. I said, you're arrested. Mm. Okay. I'll take him to the sewers and the cubes will take care of <laughs> 19, but she's resistant to magic. Like, all magic. Even healing magic. So, instead of 19 points of necrotic damage, she takes... Forty-eight. So she's she's about she's close to halfway. Um, Good for her. I'm dead. Well, dying. Be that as it may, uh, Krishna is next to unleash some hurt on these two injured cultists. Or maybe the cult guy that hasn't been hurt yet. Cult fanatic. Sort of does he leader, does he does he look guy. does he look meaner than the other ones? Like yeah. He's like he's the frothing, caster. He's frothing a little bit. He's like the caster guy. All right, I'm going to put Val of Enmity in, in on him. Oh, and yes. Then strike. Kill him. Ah, what the fuck is all that now? So, um, 18. 18. 18 definitely hits. Yeah. Bow show. With the first attack. Okay. That's right, we get two now. Yeah. There's level five. Now. So that's eight points for that one. Uh-huh. There you go. Second one hits. Nice. Nice. And that is ten points on that, so eighteen points total damage to him. Bitch. Eighteen? Bitch. Nice. Um, he's not dead yet, but you put a real nasty hurt on him. Oh, he's going to get a spike next time around. Good deal. <laughs> Oh, your javelin spears. <laughs> okay, so it's reasonable to assume that the guards have probably already heard the dude yelling. So I'm gonna. Uh, you're flying over the air, right? Yeah. You can uh, give me a perception check. Ooh. How long until my family gets here? Nineteen. Okay. You see that there are guards coming. Okay. Um, accompanying some people. That Shit. Hmm. We'll get to that. Okay. Um, I'm going to. My family's coming. With shoot the guards. a pie at the uninjured oh. assassin. Uh oh. Okay. Mm-hmm. We get trusted. Fuck me. Says. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> they won't betray the family. He says. No, it's seven. Four. Well, no, the yeah. guards have my seven. family at some point. Oh, okay. Yeah. Goddamn. Oh, they're working. Goddamn. No. Goddamn. You can't throw with the shit, son. All right. Let's roll a seventeen with that dice. To see guards. Sorry, question. Yeah. Uh, Crowley, of course you can see what's going on over there, but you've got there's. I'm down. Oh, that's right. Death saving yeah. throw. That is a two. Okay, first failure. Yay. I, I think so. Wasn't a one, so it wasn't two auto failed. That's my turn. It is. It is. Pain. Right. Um. 
I'll go ahead and... Did we finally kill that one assassin? No, he's still alive. Oh, he's still kicking? Yeah. And yeah, he's, he's hidden. Well, he has full cover. It's not necessarily that he's hidden, per se. Um, you know exactly where he is. You just can't really... Yeah. Um, okay. Is he, did he duck back down like that little alley that he was... The other side, since that was on fire. By the way, let me send Tom. Oop, doop. I know what you're doing. Percentile to see if the crates he's on are on fire. Well, no. The, the current ones that are on fire, see what's what happens with those. <laughs> 53. 53, okay. Um, fire spreads. Fire to spread some more, and some of the materials in these boxes are... Uh, Magical in nature. Flammable? <laughs> One might say. So, at the very end, kind of close to where the assassins are, it detonates. Which is good for you and bad for them. Um, good job. I'm useful. <laughs> oh, Bob. Oh. Burned down, burned down this, uh, okay. um, the Um The currently uninjured assassin um, manages to tuck and roll. That's the right? and hates us. The other one... <laughs> uh, and we're going to say for the sake of gravity that he is incinerated in the explosion. Yeah. Uh, so there's only one assassin left. Okay. <clears throat> anyway, Kane, that's your go. Um, Some trap now hits the assassin guy in the face. Okay. And fall down. I'm going to. And so I'm guessing he's the one that was on my side. I don't know. You said he he was, but then he moved over to the other side. Okay, with the other assassin. Yeah, got it. But the other and assassin managed to avoid any any of the damage because he's Asian. Okay. Uh, yeah. And, and such. So he is. Yeah. But he's there. And that's the same side I'm on. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You can see him. He's still. Like... Okay. In fact, he kind of rolled like dove forward, so he's a little bit closer. All right, he's getting the dagger in the back as he's as he's rolling. Okay, forward. I like that. I like that. Roll it. With advantage because you're super hidden. Twenty. Dirty twenty. Dirty twenty. Yeah. Because it was uh, an eleven. That will hit. Oh right. With delicious sneak attack damages. It'll be better soon. Yeah. That's lame. Uh, that's going to be a only a 13. 13 damage? Yeah. That's not insignificant. That's not no. the most lower level dudes. More than I've done. Yep. Um, and, <laughs> and I'm going to try to move farther away from where the flames are spreading. And bonus action hide again. Okay, good. So hide. Roll your hide. No, you go to the end of the line, you roll below five. <laughs> uh, that's going to be a 15. 15, okay. Got it. Flames are illuminating the area a little bit more. Hard. <laughs> it's getting, are. Um, getting harder to the hide. The assassin is... Having seen what's what's happening is actually no. Let me see what he's going to do. Okay, he's going to say and fire shot not at Crowley, but at Harriet. Oh no, no. I'm their target. True. But he is down, and they, they know well, he's not dead. They know I'm unconscious. It's disadvantage because you're prone. Uh huh. Uh, AC 17, mm -hmm. and you failed one. Mm -hmm. if, if they hit, I'm dead. If they hit you, you're dead. Don't pull punches just because it's me, man. Which doesn't mean. 
that probably is necessarily out of the game. But we'll see what happens. I came back to life. Look at me, I'm cool. So Wait! Luck point. Just uh reduce that. Uh I'll, I'll roll disadvantage. Four. Oh. <laughs> reduce that farther. I rolled a four plus his bonus is not seventeen. It's not seventeen? So it's okay. <laughs> Um, and he's actually going to uh, assassin, kind of right. tuck back where the other assassin was. They have one job, um, just to kill one person. I mean, they did a pretty good job. It's pretty much he's about, dead, yeah. uh, he's about Harriet, dead. Who is having a great time uh, <laughs> killing cultists is going to go. You do it. Go do one of those, like, start his, singing his, a song while you're uh, slaughtering your enemies. <laughs> Whistling. Her and I hope. Uh, I hope. Her, her and Popeye. <laughs> Killing oh, cultists. Um, crushing, crushing skulls. I go. This one was Popeye. Was like it. So it's an eighteen plus thing. Yeah. And then Harriet is plus six eighteen, so she hits two. All right. Let's see what we got. The damage we got. Oh, that's a six and a three. Which is uh, 9 plus 5 14. is 14, coupled with Popeye's damage, which is 5 is 19. Dang. Is that right? Yeah. Uh, the cult leader is dead. Nice. Another one uh, bites dust. So she, she hits the, the, the cult leader guy across in like the face and the skull cracks and like the eye falls. Nice. And Popeye and gets it. Popeye gets it. Yeah. <laughs> it out as, as, it, as it kind of falls down. Yeah. Brutal. Brutal. Finish him. Alright. Uh, Clank. I help him. Help! I help, I help you. With? <laughs> hey, what? <laughs> hey, you know you have that uh, that, that 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 luck ability yeah. where you can heal. Yeah, I, I will do that. Oh you yeah, gotta, yo, at the roll. You have to roll on the table. I have to roll on the table. Uh, my phone is dying or dead. Uh, let me see if I can pull it up. Really I good. thought you had a printed copy. Cool. Eli was going to, but printer kept messing up, so I never got it. Ooh. Mm. Mm. Damn it! I'm pulling it up. You are. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So I'm up. It keeps on going at one percent of the dying. It's and... percentile. Now you could heal him a bunch. Yeah. Or not a lot. Or kill me. Or kill you. <laughs> uh, I don't think that table. Really? Because I think uh, there was something. That would that... make that would make sense though. I don't, I don't think that that has. It's a one through ten thing, right? It's percentile. Oh, it's percentile. Yeah, I think it's weighted a little differently, so it, it's it's mostly heels. The shake Nah, page sixty nine. I call the recipe. Crowley, <laughs> Crowley, crawl dance. Mmm. Crowley, I will eat you. <laughs> yeah, just understand that if any of us dies, we would be a delight. <laughs> I want to fly up to him and whisper in his ear while he's unconscious. I want to eat you. <laughs> uh, random aid table? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay, so it's a D10. So, okay, that's fair. Do you spend. It's, it's one, right? Or is it two? Okay. I'm trying to remember. Q. K E. Random A. W L. One luck point. Okay. All right. Isn't that your last one? Uh, no, he's got two more. Okay. No, I got one more after this. Okay, that's right. That's right. Because you got this will be your fourth. One. This will be my fourth one. Yeah. Yeah. It's a D10. Okay. One. Roll me a d4. Hey. Hey. Anything helps. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, what's your constitution bonus? Plus two? Uh, 
Uh, plus one. No, plus one. I get two hit points. <laughs> it's two more than you had. You reset your death saves. I, I was what, I'm like, I lean in. I start shaking him. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I got him. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And you're shaking him. Um, Piece of bread falls out of the pocket. <laughs> hey, yeah, like uh, 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 one of the crates has one healing potion kind of thing in it. And most of it spills out on the ground. Like like it somehow bounces out <laughs> randomly. And uh, a drop of it falls in my mouth. Yeah. <laughs> like a single drop into his mouth. And the rest of it just seeps into the ground around him. And he's like <gasps> <laughs> he's back up with the wood. What really sucks you is that also, that also dropped my hex plates curse. Ooh boo, that sucks. Wait a minute, when did that guy die? Uh, the assassin? Yeah, because I, I need to check to see if... No, my turn. That was one that you hit? Yeah, oh. that's the one I cursed. So I need to check real quick on the hex blade about my curse. Okay, that might change things a bit. What does it do? Nope. It... I was incapacitated. Uh, okay, cool. <laughs> that's right. Yep. Yep, fair enough. Okay. Well, so you, get, you get that piece of uh, very good, very pills. good. Um, the cultists are going to try uh, again hit? to hit. I'm awake. One of them's going to try to hit Krishna. Try. It's not going to work. <laughs> nope. And then that's a natural one <laughs> against uh, Harriet. Harriet, yeah. Bad yeah. Um, what what feet did we give her? Is it sentinel? Yeah, I think so. Okay, she gets sentinel. Okay, it should be in her sheet. I had I made sure she wrote it down somewhere. It's either that or in a notebook. I don't remember. My character sheet to you. It really is. I'm I'm actually updating her character sheet. Are you gonna use that? To, to the other one because it's pretty you, rad. You gonna use the one I sent you? Yes. That thing is awesome. It's super dope. It all She's calculates its down here. Parts. Um, I think it was Sentinel, but that that's only going to work if somebody tries to move away from her while they're in melee with her. No, it actually works if uh, if someone adjacent to her attacks someone else. That's true. So I don't know. Um, I have it as Sentinel on the new sheet for now, so I'm gonna go ahead and do it. Another one? Okay, this is, this is okay. Didn't work out, that's okay. Krishna. All right, I'm gonna- Something just tried to hit you. I'm gonna go up to the, um, to the assassin that has the most health. There's only one left. Okay. No, so the alive one. So, yeah. <laughs> so the one that's not the dead. one that's dead. I just want to go uh, and start smashing. You have to run. You <laughs> don't want to make it to that. Oh, you guys still have some pool. No, there's two cultists. All right, well, yeah, I'll, I'll strike one of the cultists then. Um, first hit. That hits. I'm sure that's like. Um, yeah, that, that hits. Yeah. Twenty-one. And I'll use one um, first level divine spell smite. smite to make that divine smite. Yeah. That should be two d eight. Yeah, plus 2d8 on top of 1d8. So, 6, 10, oh, 12, yeah. 17 points. Oh, yeah, that cultist is obliterated. <laughs> Second. that cultist, like, in half down the middle. Nice. Second and radiant the white fire. And there's, like, no... no that was always such a good feeling of Witcher. Nice. Like that. <laughs> that. Lights all the way. <laughs> Lightsaber is ass. Heels in half, yeah. Can I hit the other one with the second attack? Yeah. Like, nice. My, my uh, Vengeance Pally in the other game has a Eight, sun sword. Oh, 16. really? That's cool. Holy lightsaber. <laughs> 16? Yeah. Alright, I'm going to use another first level spell spot to use Divine Smite. Ooh. So, let's see. What? Mm -hmm. um, 10, um, 15 points of damage. This <laughs> one, one, and eight. Mm -hmm. Cut in half the other direction. <laughs> nice! <laughs> Just slice, them. slice. Yeah. So there's uh, like there's like smoke wafts up from the waste, and the cultist looks surprised and confused, and then 
Nice. Like the top half falls over. Darth Maul does ass. Yes. <laughs> yes Quetzal's Krishna. Quetzal. Quetzal. All right. All right. On your turn, you catch something else on fire. Something <laughs> is going to happen. It's going to uh, be kind of visible to everyone. Uh-oh. Um, there is a flash of blue light. And I'm going to do this here. Fuck. <laughs> um, Quetzal, who had... Another hot pocket, I guess, ready for, yeah. for throwing. He's like floating. Um, lowers it and seems to be stationary up in the air. And his eyes glowing what? with the blue glow of Technos. What? Uh, what? What? what did you do? Quetzal, you, you, you appear in a space of infinite whiteness, like the hyperbolic time chamber. Ooh, reference. Uh, <laughs> Standing before you is a tall, robed figure with the face of an alien skull, whose eyes glow vibrant blue. Ooh. He's uh, your friend. As the technology Are you itself. <laughs> says, it's time for you to fulfill your duty owed to us. <gasps> oh, you son of a This is for when you died. Ooh. Ooh. The robed figure says, as the other nine day awards appear as well. You seem to be of all different uh, types. Races. Looking at them, you can tell that the skulls, the like, sort of skull representations are different. Um, I have a veil lord in my sword. Uh, let's see. I'll have to kill you. The one who <laughs> that'd be great. The one who summoned you appeared to be alien, of course. The others appear as human, elf, dwarf, gnome, orc, Anubis, Mal, Gorgon, and Tesquatch. Tesquatch. Sassafras. The Sasquatch one's eating some beef jerky. <laughs> <laughs> Got it. And again, the avian says it's time for you to fulfill the duty owed to us. And that is where we will end. Ooh. Oh, oh, shit. Oh. Ah. Oh. We're out of Cliffhanger. <laughs> it is. It is a cliffhanger. That's your monster. So, uh, we have... At this point... I'm fairly certain everyone else has leveled up. Um, but not I until will, after combat? Not until after the combat and everything goes. So don't worry about doing that yet. I will let you know. It's still entirely possible that I will die in this encounter. Yeah. Yes, it is. I might be the one to kill you. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is. With a fork to the neck. Oh my gosh. Wouldn't be the first time he's done that. Yeah. I mean, here's the thing. Piss off the guy of this town. Like, the, 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 the one dude. You don't piss off. Yeah, you don't piss off. Um, How the boys going to get out of this one? We'll find out tune in the next one. <laughs> <laughs> the Tales of Mystery. <laughs> All right, we're going to have a little break, and then we'll come back and have the sort of after party where we, you know, pick things up. All that fun jazz. So, yeah, for now. I recently my uh